someone crying. Little girls crying in horror games makes it 10 times more creepy. Ooh, that's unsettling. Hey, what's up, Seder? And welcome back to 3 Scary Games. Our first game for today is... Excuse you? Dad, I'm scared. Let's just dive into it. Because this crying girl is disturbing me. I think she's now laughing. What the? Um, daughter? Liz? Elizabeth? Are you alright? Oh, Don't cry, it was just a nightmare. Oh, Emily. Dad, I'm scared. Something is... Okay. Is that a bit better? I think. I think so. Okay. Um... Okay, okay, Jesus, Emily, Jesus Christ. You can cry up a storm here. Okay, something's the house, I'm sure. I heard odd noises and saw something moving in the corridor. Can you search the house? Please, Daddy. Please, Papa. Please. Okay. Do I really have to hold the mouse to enable the... Claire? This is not Resident Evil, daughter. Do I really have to hold the mouse to enable the flashlight here? And why do we have a very long corridor? What's this? What the frick? Do we have an art studio for a house? Is that a ladder? Is that Jack's... L oh my god, what is this? Okay, okay, this is a very strange house. I see Jack's ladder and I see uh, a ball. Okay. Um. Okay. Oh, I have to hold the light. Okay. Why is it so goddamn dark? Emily, did you forget to turn off the TV again? Oh, crap. You guys may not see it because I'm gonna edit this, but it's really damn dark. Emily! You left the threads in- Oh, those are not threads. Those are jars. You left the jams again on the floor. And they're doing the dinosaur. I don't know if that's that how that song goes, but... Yeah, it's a very old song and I can't remember most of it. Okay. Oh crap! Emily! What? What? Oh my god. Emily, oh, did you trip? You better have tripped. I don't want to see a monster inside of your room, okay? What? What? I'm holding it, but nothing is happening. Do I hear insects eating you inside of there? What the frick? Um, wait. No, seriously. I'm pointing at it and there is... It's still there. It's not disappearing. Okay. I just needed... Oh my god. Oh my god. A giant spider. Okay. Okay, that was nice. <laughs> okay, okay, that was nice. It just really thrown you in there and I think that had a sense of dread in it and it just suddenly jolts your anxiety up because you just, your daughter is crying, something strange is going in the house, you see these odd looking balls that disappears once you point your light at them. So yeah, the confusion is also there. Really nice really nice experience over here so yeah there you have it that's the first game so let's move on to the next one okay this is the second game it's called forgotten tunnels i've seen in the description that it's a short horror experience and there's just something about crawling into tight dark spaces that 
that just triggers our primal instincts of fear. <laughs> Let's dive into it, shall we? Oh, hell yeah. Here we go, baby. Oh, hell yeah. It's like going down to the basement. That fear that crawls up, up your neck, your spine, your nape. <laughs> don't you feel the chills? Like it's dark, mysterious. You don't know what's coming to get you. Ah, oh, interesting. There's a bit of light at the end of the tunnel. What do we have here? Ooh. Uh, excuse me, I just had a little sip of my coffee there. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> really having fun here. It's like going into a horror house and you don't know what you're gonna get. I hope this game is more of an atmosphere kind of horror game and not just some cheap jump scares. PT. This is like PT. Am I going the same? I can't run so yeah it makes me lazy to go back up to see if something has changed. It's basically it. I know there's an SCP but no 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 it's not a tunnel. It's more of a staircase. An endless staircase SCP. But the gist of it is that it's like um, PT. As you progress along, there's you'll notice some changes and it will lead you to your certain doom. Oh my god. What? I thought I heard something. Mm. Oh my god, this is a super long one. Oh crap. <laughs> I like that. I love that. I no really, I really love that. It's not a cheap jump scare, it just this game scares you with the ambience. Like what's that rumbling over there? Ooh, I love it. Mm. Seriously, I love it. It just entices your curiosity to the point that it scares you. The mystery scares you. The fear of the unknown. H.P. Lovecraft was onto something. Oh crap, what's that? Like, it makes you hesitant to go forward once you see something out of the ordinary. I love the dread. I love it. Okay. Plus, you can't run. You're just super slow. <laughs> really enjoying it. Are we going to find a gator here? I can see a sewer and we all know that sewer water equals gator if uh, if Resident Evil has taught us about anything. Oh my god. I have no way forward. I can't interact with anything. What's that making the sound? Do you want me to go back up? Ooh. Genuinely terrifying. I have to be honest here. I am genuinely not spooked. That was not there before. What the frick? I'm going down. I'm going down again. Oh my god. This game plays with you. I love it. True. Oh my. That was a cheap jump scare. 
I did not appreciate that. Okay, I can't go in here. Okay. Okay. We're going to follow the mole man. Okay, okay, alright, alright. Okay. Seriously, we're going to follow the mole man? Mmm, that. That I can appreciate. That I approve. Just someone slowly walking in the darkness. It's not a cheap jump scare. That is a legitimately perfectly good use of creep factor. Okay. 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 All right. All right. What I like what it did at the, what do you call this, at the stairs, I thought I was going up, but then I suddenly didn't notice that I was going down. I really like that. Okay. We're in the sewers again. <coughs> okay. It got me a bit. Bam. But I prefer those. Gripping in the distance, I prefer that. Okay, I, I think I have been loaded on... Yep, I've been loaded into a different level here. Okay. What? The frick. Are the walls whispering to me? Mm, this, this, this right here. My hesitation to move forward. I love that. I love that feeling of dread. Okay. Are you trying to tell me something, buddy, old pal? What's in here? I know this game just funnels you in. Okay, I'm gonna go there. Because that, that door is open. Or did it suddenly load it out? That is the case in most of these horror games. Oh no, okay. Okay, alright. I am really quiet right now because I am generally terrified. <laughs> I know this is an experience and that I think that no one is trying to kill me or nothing is going to kill me. Curiouser and curiouser. Yeah, nothing is going to kill me, I think. But, yeah. Am I supposed to follow the whispering? It brought us back up. Okay. Okay. Curiouser and curiouser. Okay, looks clear to me. Okay, mm -hmm. I don't like it when games... That looks bad. And that looks like the end of this game. Okay, let's meet our doom with both dignity and grace. Let's welcome that as an old friend. Okay? Okay. Come! I will meet my doom! Oh my god. Oh my god. 
Oh my god. Oh my god. To those who have fear of holes, oh, those are not holes. I better get moving. Oh my god, this is so Silent Hill vibes. Love it. Oh, oh my god. I love this experience. What's that? Yep, that just complete. Oh my god. ruined it I think a creature walking towards me <laughs> really man you're gonna end it like that okay okay some might enjoy it but me I think I don't I would have preferred to have you know stumble into a room and then like face the creature like have him standing there and then facing me and then Fade the black like that the end we all know what's going to happen once you enter the room and there's a creature there Yeah But yeah The, <laughs> the creature running towards me. Yeah, it kind of ruined the experience man <laughs> Yeah, I, I have nothing against cheap jump scares, but <laughs> I Don't appreciate them that much Okay, but anyway, it was a good experience I'm gonna give it like a 9 out of 10. It was really good. Really like the whole process of it. Really gave me chills to my spine. And let's move on to the next game. Oh, hello there. What do we have here? This game is a bit strange. It didn't announce itself as a horror game or any kind of game. Just a normal game, a point and click game. Cute art style, decent gameplay, but I found it in a horror tag in itch.io. It was recommended to me as a horror game. So yeah, it interests me like Doki Doki Literature Club because on the sweet facade or sweet visage of Doki Doki Literature Club, there is... A deep dark sinister undertone to it something crawls in your body and this shitty situation I'm ready but someone has the same thing too what there will be one room a bathroom what would you do in there choose wisely inspired by true events oh this is not a traditional horror game are you ready? Ready. I'm... Good luck. Okay, 9 p.m. Oh, shit! <laughs> Literally shit! Okay, uh, toilet paper. Okay, uh, I have diarrhea. Um, what do I do? Guess I'm stuck. Forever? <laughs> Is that just me? Fid fiddling with my phone in the bathroom. Seriously? Oh wait. I can text my dad for the toilet paper. <laughs> oh <laughs> my phone just died. Mother <laughs> ending. Shit happens. Okay. Is this a horror game? I don't know. Um Kleenex, cup, faucet, um, Bathtub. Um, what do I do? Oh, I'm guessing your brother also has diarrhea because both of you ate and you have a sister. Okay, maybe eat them both. <laughs> what? Why would you do that for? I don't know. Now he's- Thanks to you. That little boy wants to take a shit. <laughs> Wait, what? Did I just make my character jump out the window? What? Okay, I'm gonna explore a bit more because 
Oh, drawer. Oh, um, long drawer. Answer to number one is times eight. I need my handy dandy calculator. Let me just wait. Okay. Okay, BRB. <laughs> Seriously, the code is just 6969. 696. Enter. What's this? Get stick bug low. What? What kind of what kind of bug is that? Okay, um from what I read in the description there are four endings and one Easter egg. Okay, let me just check it. Oh, okay, okay. I'm not supposed to Ah, oh, there we go. We have It's open, right? I'm clicking everything I can see in here. Okay, I have a bathtub. No, 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 don't press the window again. Oh, do I need to find toilet paper? Okay, toilet paper. Found a toilet paper. Okay. Oh, this is your stuff? Okay, your name is Dave. What's your brother's name? Or sister? Kate? I don't know. Okay, I we have toilet paper, so should we just take a shit? <laughs> okay, wipe your ass. Oh. <laughs> Is that it? Okay, do we just leave? Perfect shit. How is this a horror game? There are four endings. Okay, I got three of them now. What? What's... Um, I don't know what to do in this game anymore. <laughs> I can't find any secret. I don't know if that bug thing in here is... Yeah, I don't know if that's a s bug or <laughs> an actual secret. I don't know man, I don't know, I don't know. Why does your um, brother's name, little bro? Okay, K, little bro, <laughs> I'm really sorry but I'm gonna take a shit before all of you. I don't know man, I don't know. I'm just gonna leave a link in the description below just in case you want to try it out. Yeah, because it's curious, like this was listed as a horror game when I searched for it. I don't know man, I don't know. So yeah, there you have Okay. So yeah, there you have it. Those are three scary games question mark. I guess there's just something scary about watching a guy poop. Okay. That's all the time I have for this video. And as always, if you want more contents like this, give me subs, give me likes, and give the bell a ring in the nuts, and I'll see you saters in my next video. So, bye-bye.